Hello, my name is David. Have you ever wondered how much we depend on electricity for our everyday life? Let's just close our eyes for a minute. Think of living in a home. We've got no lighting or no TV. Today's presentation, I hope you will gain some understanding of how electricity is produced in a modern coal-fired power station. The first part of the process, coal is mined in large open cut mines or underground, then the coal is transported to large coal bunker storage areas at the power plant. It's transported using conveyor or large trucks. The coal arrives in large chunks of coal, so it has to be sent to what's called a pulverising fuel mill to be ground into very fine powder, or PF. The PF is then blown into the boiler and mixed with large amounts of air to produce large amounts of heat, just similar to the large amount of heat coming from your fire in your home. This enormous 12-storey boiler evaporates over 2,000 litres of purified water in a superheated steam every hour at a temperature of 540 degrees. The steam is then fed with tremendous force into what's called a turbine. The steam acts on the turbine blades and rotates the turbine actually at 3,000 revs per minute. Finally, at the last stage of the turbine, the steam, the spent steam, is then sucked through the condenser where it hits the cooling water tubes in the condenser, which then condense the actual steam back to purified water and is returned to the boiler. The cooling water comes from large lakes or cooling towers and is recirculated through the condenser. The turbine is coupled or connected to the generator. The generator has two main pieces. The stator, which are large coils cylindrically grouped around the stator, and a rotator. The rotor rotates within the stator. The rotor is a large electromagnet. This produces electricity in the generator. The power is then sent to a transformer where the voltage is increased to 500,000 volts so it could be transported across large distances using these large transmission towers. In conclusion, the coal process delivers the coal to the boiler to produce the heat and produce the steam. The steam cycle, which uses steam to rotate the turbine. The cooling water cycle, which cools the steam back into purified water for the boiler. And finally, the electrical generation process, which uses a turbine and a generator to produce electricity. I hope you've learned a lot today, or some things anyway, about how electricity is produced in a modern coal-fired power station, and many thanks for your time.